Hello and welcome to The Social Talks. I am Jasmine, your news anchor for today, and I will be discussing a recent video circulating social media from a UK ex-Labour MP. A video of Sir Gerald Kaufman from 2009 has resurfaced on social media amid Israel's current attack on Palestinians. He speaks out about himself being brought up as part of the Jewish community and a Zionist, where he, along with his family, contributed monetary gifts to enhance Israel's presence in Palestine. He goes on to explain that his family moved to Britain as refugees from Poland and many members of their families were murdered during the Holocaust. Explicitly, he states that his grandmother was shot in her bed by Nazis while trying to survive World War II. He then goes on to suggest that these actions are being repeated and Israeli militants are shooting Palestinian grandmothers much like the Nazis back in World War II. He also suggests that the Israeli murders of Palestinians have been justified time and time again by the guilt from the treatment of Jews in the Holocaust. Gerald Kaufman then shows disagreement with the 2009 spokeswoman of the Israeli army, Major Leibovok, for her response when asked about the Israeli killing of nearly 1,000 Palestinians, to which she replied with the words, 500 of them were militants. Kaufman suggests that her reply was a reply of a Nazi, as Jews in Poland could have been dismissed as militants during the Holocaust, which is no different to what the Major was doing back in 2009. He goes on to express that the Israeli Foreign Minister of 2009 would not be dealing with Hamas as they are terrorists, before saying Israel was born out of Jewish terrorism. He goes on to describe terrorist acts performed by Israeli terrorist groups and blames the failings of Fatah, an Israeli leader, that Hamas won the Palestinian election in 2006. Kaufman does this shortly followed by his condemnation of Hamas and their acts and his belief that the reaction of worldwide governments towards Hamas has been an error which has led to dreadful consequences. He suggests the problem cannot be solved by military means and suggests imposing a total ban on Israel. He justifies these statements by saying that regardless of the outcome, there will still be millions of Palestinians being unfairly treated by Israelis. Kaufman states that it is time for real peace. He ends his statement by saying that they are not just war criminals, they are fools. But what do you think? Do you think Gerald Kaufman's statement is still relevant and can be applied to the most recent outbreak of destruction in Gaza? Thank you for your time listening to this story. I have been Jasmine, your news anchor. Goodbye.